Hey everyone, welcome back to my channel. So this video is going to be on the Sephora play box that we received for the month of February. Some of you guys may have seen that I did not do a Sephora play box for January. And the reason why is because I did have to update my card information. I forgot about the Sephora play box and I forgot to update that information. So I had gotten an email notification from them saying to update the information. So I tried to go on there, but I was I kept getting an error when I was trying to upload it. So um, I kept procrastinating and then I contacted Sephora and I updated the information and they had it good to go, but it was only gonna kick in till February. So um, I apologize for not uploading one for January, but that was the reason why I did not have one uploaded then. But we're gonna get right into it. We're gonna go ahead and see what we got for this month. One of the things that I noticed about this box is that the card itself, it's usually a big poster that we receive and you guys have seen it it's humongous this one is pretty small it's cute though don't get me wrong it's super cute valentine's day themed here but it is pretty small which i like because i didn't need such a big poster i think this is just quite good these are the products that came in here for the month of february so the first thing that i got here is this and this is the Sika pear and this is the Derma Green Solution Correcting Treatment SPF 30. Apply this to your skin and before a foundation for a skin spray sun protection. I've actually had gotten this before in the past and I really loved it. I took it to my trip to Hawaii and I used it and I thought it was such a nice treatment to apply underneath your foundation. And it does give you that small layer of protection for the sun, but apply it here. So I'm gonna apply this. I really liked how smooth that applies. A nice barrier on your face. Next up is this really itty bitty tiny Josie Moran 100% pure organ oil i've actually used this and i have a bottle i just actually finished it too i really like this oil i usually apply some when i'm not doing anything i don't really do it underneath my makeup though i don't really like to apply oils underneath my makeup because then i get really oily but for the sake of this video i'm gonna just apply some on my face just since we're getting all the products in here i'm gonna go ahead and just put it on my face but typically i don't like to do it underneath my foundation because my face already gets oily so this just makes it a little bit too oily but I like to use this occasionally if I don't have any makeup on and I'm not doing anything I'm just kind of like hanging out at the house I will put on a nice face mask and just apply that on so that way it just gives me a nice hydration nice it's a nice oil to apply on your face Peter Thomas raw and this is a hydrolonic cloud cream so this is like a this is a moisturizer it's a water drench hydrating moisturizer it hydrates your skin for 72 hours it's gonna be a complete mess i know because i'm applying every single thing it's <laughs> for the heck of it i'm applying it on my face as well very nice and smooth <laughs> and then no smell to this at all and i have never tried any of peter thomas products at all so I think this would be a really nice experiment to try and see if I really like this. I received this and this is the Playa and this is the everyday shampoo and conditioner supernatural shampoo and conditioner. I already washed my hair so I can't really use this but I will try it out and then try to give you guys an opinion on that. I'll put that aside and this is just a bonus it's not part of the five typically with Sephora Playbox you get five products and sometimes they do a bonus so this is just one of the bonus that they throw in there. So the next little guy here is this Tarte Rain Seawater Foundation Broad Spectrum SPF 15 and this is a foundation. So I've actually used this before on my channel and I believe I actually got this in the Sephora play box as well in the past and I really liked this so I'm just going to go ahead and just use it again but I do remember I like this foundation it was really nice so I'll go ahead and put that on my face and then the last product is a powder so we're going to go ahead and I'll speed through this really quickly do my makeup put on the foundation and then I will pause when I get to that powder section so
so really nice coverage that it gives me it's not full coverage I would say it's like somewhat of a medium coverage I absolutely like this it makes it look like it's pretty natural I really like that foundation So the next one that I got is the Kat Von D and this is the setting powder. So I'm just going to grab a little bit of this and I'm on the eyes. Ooh, I'm going to apply some on the rest of my face. Alright, so that setting powder was quite nice. I, I have tried her setting powder before and I do think it's a really good setting powder. So that was the last item. I'm just going to quickly finish the eyes. Alrighty guys, so that was pretty much it. I just put on a small amount of shimmer and then just put some mascara. I didn't even put on some lashes. I wanted this to be kind of like, almost like a natural look. And I used most of these products and I used everything except for the shampoo and conditioner. I really overall liked this box because I already know that I like the Josie Moran oil. I use this all the time, I have one. And I really like the Dr. Brand Sika, Sika Pear Tiger Grass Color Correcting Treatment. I again mentioned this, I really like this. And I haven't tried this moisturizer yet besides today, so I'm gonna definitely look into seeing if this is any good. The setting powder, of course, I really like the setting powder, it was nice. And foundation, I have used it before, I think it's a really nice foundation and it makes it look more natural. So overall, really good box. Again, $10 for this box that I pay monthly. The only down part is that it did not have the bonus points. I think they just went away with giving those extra bonus points. A while back they used to do like 20 extra points. If you spend over a certain amount, you just use that promo but they don't have anything in this box, so that is pretty sad. But um, overall, $10 is not bad for getting these little small products and then trying them out and seeing if you like them to purchase the bigger product. I hope you guys did enjoy this video. Please subscribe to my channel and hit the notification bell. We'll see you guys in my next video. Bye.